When I was in the film experience my freshman year, we studied avant-garde film, and one of the films we watched is Fernand Ledger's Ballet Mécanique. A black and white film that played with shapes and objects and textures and patterns without really having a narrative. And I thought that it would be something really fun to do for an art project. What if I could make these patterns explore space rather than explore rhythm or temporality? I printed out 120 frames from Ballet Mécanique and I hung them up in sets of three all the way along a wall and all the way back around. So it created a space where you walked in and you were spatially surrounded by the film rather than being absorbed temporally in the film. And then I also projected the film on the wall so that you could have both and you could look at how things happen with music and according to time and flashing really fast so that you don't really exactly get what each object is versus having them all around you where you can really see what each frame is. So even doing this project, there were frames that happened so quickly in the film that I'd never even noticed before. Like there's a typewriter, for instance, that flashes across the screen that doesn't seem very important. And yet when you look at it on the space and see the variety of the images, it becomes a whole new experience. I don't know if it becomes a very cinematic experience. I think that it might be something totally different or completely non-film, but it was, it was an interesting project and it really forced me to think about not just the images or the aesthetic or the patterns, but think about what rhythm and what cuts do to a film, how they change how you absorb the information.